plaintiff, Kiana Jackson, dated the defendant, and they have two children together. But Kiana claims the defendant puts women, money, and drugs before his kids. Kiana's suing her ex for the value of a car and a refund on a car. Defendant Laquan Smith insists he is a perfect father who has always financially supported his children. Laquan claims he has doubts about fathering Kiana's children, so he petitioned the court for a paternity test. All rise. This court is now in session. The Honorable Judge Greg Mathis presiding. You may now be seated. Ma'am, you're suing your ex-boyfriend for $2,790. Yes, sir. And you're petitioning the court today for a DNA test. Yes, sir. All right. And you all have a child together, <laughs> someone believes? Two. We have two. Okay. Yes. I'll start with you. All right, Your Honor. The reason why we're here today is because Quan puts, Laquan, puts um, women, money, and drugs before his children. And My both. two children. Um, in 2011, I met Laquan at work. Um, we worked together. Um, things actually happened pretty fast. Um, within like a week or so, I met his mom and his other family members. Um, and then shortly after that, I ended up pregnant. Actually, my life was in a, a slight amount of turmoil. Um, I just had lost my grandfather before I found out that I was pregnant. Um, in January of 2012, mm -hmm. I had gave birth to my first daughter. Um, and after that, actually, everything changed. Um, everything else was more important than our daughter. He was still living life like nothing had changed. Um, going out, drinking with coworkers, um, How old out with was friends. He at that time, he was 20, and I was 22. Okay, and um, you expected all of his uh, partying ways and hanging out ways uh, would be over at age 20. No, that's not what I'm implying. What I, what I imagined was that based on the fact that it was a new experience for the both of us, mm -hmm. that we would both put forth enough effort for it to be what was best for the child. Yeah, but you made reference to him hanging out as if that was part of the problem. Going out. It wasn't in part the of club. the problem, but okay. what I'm saying is once I had my daughter, I, I had to. I that part, ma'am, but you, I'm just trying to establish to you at age 20, he's not going to be home. So all you ladies who think you can have babies by a 20-year-old and he's going to be around, no. <laughs> he's going to be hanging out with his fellas, drinking and going to the club, doing everything that a 20-year-old does. So let me hear from you. Well, in the beginning, like she said, we did, well, we actually met in 2010, November. Uh, we started getting sexually active in March of 2011. She got pregnant in April. Um, I was born in 91. I was 21 years old in 2012 when I had my child. I was, I'm a perfect father. Always been there for my child from You're the honest. beginning. Been to every single doctor's appointment. I was always there. Um, she said there was a problem after our first child, but she had a second child with me. How long after the first child did you have a second? Four. You say four years later. I guess you may have changed back. Because four years know. later, she had another, she had another child with me. No, he so. was still the same. So why would you have, why would you have another one with me? Because at the end of the day, throughout the course of us, throughout mm -hmm. that four years mm -hmm. that was in the middle of that, I was mm -hmm. trying to give him the opportunity to become a better man in the sense four of... Four years, perhaps, she should have noticed. But I, I had a lot going on in my own life, too. Go so ahead. I wasn't there emotionally to be supportive, but I was always there financially. My household... Our household was always taken care of. I paid all the bills. I made sure her, my kid, my daughter, before our second daughter came, I made sure both of their hair was fixed, clothes, food on the table, whatever. I do have a um, drug criminal record or whatever that I... For what? I don't... Um, Selling? Huh? Selling? Yeah. Large so, amounts? Uh, yeah. Yes. No wonder you took care of the house so oh, well. That's yeah. good that you spent the money on that. So you Not know, good uh, that you made it illegally, but I'm glad to hear you spent right. it on that. But I paid, I, I did my time, I paid for my crime. You know, that's, that's yeah. over with. All right. You know, but uh, really at this point, she's, I feel like she's just upset that I moved on to my life with uh, my other, my new significant other. Um, in the process of us dealing through the years, I was dealing with her. Um, Cheating. Were you all planning these children? First one was actually planned. She the said it wasn't. The first one was not planned. Okay. The actually, second one? The second one wasn't planned. And the second one, I have doubts about. 
but I've always That's been, what the DNA I you al- have doubts yeah. about. I've okay. always been a father to right. the child since day one, though. Okay. Why are you suing the defendant? Uh, back in 2017, he purchased me an Acura because he was in jail um, since February 14th of 2017. Um, and then he got out, like, November of 2018. We just had started back talking, because while he was in jail, throughout the course of the time, I chose that I didn't want to, you see what I'm saying, like, interact with him, because he still had, um, the previous relationship going on, so I chose to be done with it. You saw um, your children, though, then. Me? Uh, no. She didn't <laughs> let you see your children? Maybe, like, the first two or three Is weeks. Is that true? You denied him that? access to a children? I'm not denying him access to my children. I just chose mm-hmm. that I didn't want to take my kids to a, a jail. <laughs> but you did it all before. Okay, what about when he got out of jail? You let him... Well, when he got out of jail... Did you let yeah, him see his children? Yeah, he was still seeing his children, yes. Okay, good enough. Go ahead. He took the Acura out of my sister's yard, um, where it was being stored, because I was staying with her. When? hmm April of 19. Okay. And um, he pretty much took it and signed it over into his name. I, my sister said that she came oh. outside. I did file a police report yeah. on it. Let me hear from you, sir. Okay, so when I came, when I got released from prison, um, my girlfriend came to pick me up. Uh, she bought me clothes, shoes, phone, and she also gave me a vehicle. You know, me and her had a few couple of, couple of ups and downs. She'll take the car from me, which would leave me carless. I'll probably have to borrow my sister's car, my mama's car or something. So, talk to me and her was already involved at that point in time. I basically explained myself to her about, oh, I'm tired of going through this back and forth with my girlfriend. She keep taking a car, this, that, and a third, so I need a car, you know, and I'm thinking about getting this car that's Camry from uh, one of my cousins. Mm-hmm. So by that point... Uh, when did you buy that? I actually didn't buy it. He actually... You said I got it I from him. I got it him. from him. He well, gave it to You stole it from him, too? Like, oh, you stole he just, he just gave me the title. What do you mean, got? He gave me the title to okay, the car. Okay, he gave it to you as a right. gift. And the, yes, in the process okay. of that, uh, of him giving me the when car... When was that? February. Go ahead. All right, so boom. I decided that I actually didn't need the car because by that time... The Toyota. Right. Mm-hmm. She had given me the title back to the Acura. The Acura was originally my car from the beginning. Before I went to prison, I bought that car in 2016. Mm-hmm. When I got arrested and I was sitting in the county and... Like I said, the first, what, three or four weeks she came mm-hmm. to bring the kids to see me, minutes on the phone, stuff like that. When those two clashed inside the, inside the, uh, the, the visitation room, she just stopped coming. You gave her that car, though? No, I never gave her the Acura. You loaned it to her? No. We would, she at that, stole it from you? <laughs> if you want to see it, yeah, she stole it from me. Okay. Okay. Okay, How so did this, she quiet, this man? This is what happened. How did she get it from When you? I got arrested, we were living together. Mm-hmm. So she had all my belongings at the house. Mm-hmm. So she had access to everything. Mm-hmm. So when she found the title to the car, mm-hmm. she forged my signature on the title and got the car switched in her name. Okay. I never told her. She never paid for it. None of that. It was mine. No, when I came right. home, that's why she was so willing to give me the title back mm-hmm. because I was helping her. I, got, I helped her get inside the Camry, the uh, 2003 Camry. All right, so she forged the title. That's the point exactly. there. What about the uh, Toyota you're suing for? Uh, the Toyota was the car that his cousin said that he had available, um, and he mentioned it to me, and I told him that I was interested in a vehicle. Mm-hmm. So um, I gave him originally a $400 payment, which he said was necessary for his cousin to give the vehicle, you know, give the vehicle over. Mm-hmm. Um, and that was in February, and then I got the vehicle. He dropped it off to my job one day. And um, everything was fine with it until he actually was trying to ask me for the Acura, for which it was sitting in my sister's yard. It wasn't actually me the Toyota, stealing the Toyota, what car. is the uh, refund? Why do you want a refund? Did you because pay Because I no longer dollars? have, correct, and I no longer have the vehicle okay. because... Okay, he took it back? Yes. Okay. And yes. have you had discussions with him? Yes. And what yes, and I have. Um, yes, I have to find to look through my text message. I actually told him because he was telling me that he got a new job, mm-hmm. um, and that he needed transportation to get back and forth to work. Mm-hmm. So I was letting him know that um, at the end of the day, I would since he was going back and forth with me about both well, of us. You can't read from over there. 
I'm <laughs> trying to see her evidence. I'm just, I'm just seeing you, it visually. You, you about to be busted, obviously. I oh, what, you went to jail, man. You got to be a better criminal. <laughs> uh, clearly, you about to be busted because you're trying to see what evidence she got. Uh -oh. I, I, I need to see That's what's what going on. That's exactly what you were doing. <laughs> trying to read her evidence. I just get, want to see what's going on, you know? Because I know you got it, and he knows you have it. Yeah, been, or he's wondering if you have it. <laughs> In the meantime, sir, why do you doubt the uh, paternity? Well, 2015, I was on house arrest for like 10 months. Mm -hmm. uh, 2015, April, I got off of house arrest. Um, me and her took a vacation to California, but I was living, me and her was living together. He was she found, you know, with her. she found out about it or whatever. Right. She's a vulnerable person. My, one of my homeboys always go by my house every day to check on my you house. Give him a key to our house. So mm -hmm. I felt that her and my homeboy actually had some dealings while you I was gone. You sent him over there. <laughs> hey, but you I need you, to you know really, you send him over I, there. But see, yeah, I did send him over there. I ain't tripping over the fact okay. because at that point we wasn't together. Uh, you know oh, what I'm saying? Okay. We was living Got together, it. but we wasn't in a relationship. Got it. All so, right. Um, that's why I basically I have doubts about it. I don't remember okay. actually being sexually active at that point in time with her because she actually it right. was saying that she got pregnant in April. And you say both the children are his, ma'am? Yes, sir. Okay. Why don't you go and get the results and uh, take in your minute over there. <laughs> Let me see your papers. I go through them. Yeah, there's a lot going on these. over here, Lord. Here you go, Lord sir. Lord have mercy. That's... I rarely do this, but pages. you are a mother of two, and he didn't run off with another woman. Who is this threatening? I'm about to come by. I'm going to you this up. This guy. <laughs> that was him. And he know him. Scary that. B. That was, that, that, that and wasn't that, even. And mind you, all of that, that was happening while he was her. supposed to be talking to her. That wasn't to towards her. her. It was that towards that me, was towards my... whoever she was with at that point in time. I'm going to tow the car and me. give you back. Uh-oh. See, this is what you needed. I'm going to tow the car and give you back the money that you paid on it. Mm. And you should get a new phone today. Because, cause Your Honor, I had, all right, because... You know, it's already proven. Now, you don't need to say anything else. Okay. I'm reading it. I just read it. So, you busted real quick. I knew you were wrong. We <laughs> well, listen. When you start doing all that, I said, oh, So, listen, yeah. listen. He knew she was about to break out with something <laughs> that busted him. <laughs> and Laquan Smith, you are the father of both daughters. You need to stop all Sorry, that. Sorry, you Stop Sorry, it. You have a good day. You got to do for the plane. Like, I'm not even like going to argue with Kiana, you. Kiana, don't play with me. I don't, don't have time. Don't play with me in this court. Right. What you want to do, though, is what I'm saying. I would disrespect you. I would disrespect you, I would disrespect you, bad. Thanks. Overall, <laughs> she, does, she just, just doesn't want... We ain't got nothing to go with. She doesn't want to make, do make it like I'm creating a family with my kids with Point another blank. female. Point That's blank. why she's so angry. Regardless if I don't have kids I or not, when I get my god kids, I get him, his, his kids as well. I have reached out to this girl as far as on his behalf to get his kids or whatever. I was better or petty or felt any type of way about this, then I wouldn't have, you know, I wouldn't be involved with this. But at the end of the day, she's, she's, be she's very bitter. She's very bitter. What's Thanks. the reason for you keeping my well, kids from me? Well, I have no problem no with What's her, the and you she's going to say what she me. wants to say because that's him, her, but at the end of the day, that has nothing to do with anything.